Sicilian defense, French variation. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. White played a bit better than Black in the opening. White was a cut above Black in the middle game. White outmaneuvered Black in the end game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The C pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the D4 square. Nf3 moves the knight toward the center in anticipation of a pawn push on D4, where it will be ready to retake the piece if black captures on D4. The dark squared bishop has a fresh opening created by E6, and the queen has a new diagonal created by E6. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. This ignores an opportunity to develop a knight off its starting square. It is a mistake. This ignores an opportunity to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. It is the final book action. This misses a chance to build a knight outside of its beginning square. It is incorrect. Backs off. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. This prevents the opponent from castling, which generates tactical opportunities by keeping the king in the center. It is good. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This strikes a rival knight. It is ideal. This move puts the knight on a safer square. This threatens to prevent castling. It is good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This stops the opponent from being able to prevent castling. It is best. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. There was just one smart move to be made. This is a missed chance to kick a knight. It is incorrect. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. It falls flat. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. This is the only move that works. This threatens to kick a knight. It is a great move. This misses a better way to develop a queen off its starting square. It is a mistake. This strikes a rival knight. It is ideal. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to retreat away. It is ideal. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. Castling develops a rook, while also getting the king to safety. By castling to the opposite side of the board as the opponent, the game will tend to be more double-edged. It is excellent. The pawn is now adequately defended. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. This can indicate that a knight was attacked. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This exposes an attack, threatening a knight. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The knight is now sufficiently protected. It is ideal. This is the only good move. This threatens to attack a trapped knight. It is a great move. This loses a pawn. This allows the opponent to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. It is ideal. This ignores a better way to recapture a piece. This allows the opponent to pin a rook to the king. It is an inaccuracy. As a result, the rooks are placed in a single file and are able to cooperate to pose a danger. That's good. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. It is best. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. 
This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Backs off. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. That was a great move and very hard to find. It is brilliant. Recaptures. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Though not the best move technically, it was interesting. It is quite good. Backs off. It is ideal. From a prior move, recaptures. Black is losing because the end game has begun. It is ideal. This divides up parts by launching multiple attacks at once. It is ideal. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This makes winning a pawn a possibility. It is quite good. This results in a pawn being lost. It is incorrect. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. This avoids the queen's check. It is quite good. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is best. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. Recaptures. This can indicate that a pawn is being attacked. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This exposes a pawn attack. It is quite good. This comes in several sections. It is ideal. This protects a bishop who was being attacked and lacked defense. It is quite good. This captures a bishop and eliminates a threat. It is best. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. White played a bit better than black in the opening. White was a cut above black in the middle game. White outmaneuvered black in the end game. 